Hi, I'm Dr. David Cathcart from Heartland Regional Medical Center in St. Joseph, Missouri. And we're going to talk a little bit about the harmful effects of cancer and how it is that people actually die from cancer. In one of the earlier segments, you may have seen that uh, where I talked about how cancer divides and can spread to other parts of the body. Essentially what cancer does is as it grows, it becomes uh, the mass of cells as they grow uncontrollably get larger and larger and take up more and more space. So if, for example, in a case of, of the brain, uh, where there is a fixed amount of space inside the skull, as those cancer cells grow, they start to put pressure on sensitive brain tissue and that can, that can ultimately cause death. Another way that this happens is the, the cells can break off from this growing mass of tumor cells and move to other parts of the body and implant themselves in other vital organs, again causing new little seeds of growth. And when the cells break off and move to other parts of the body and start to grow, that's what we refer to as metastasis. Ultimately, as these cancer cells grow, because they require nutrition, they tend to rob nutrition from other parts of the body that need it. And so, essentially, we can die from uh, malnutrition. There's another way we die from cancer. So, probably one of the most common ways of, of, of death from cancer is because uh, either it's a space occupying lesion that presses on surrounding sensitive tissue or it robs other organs and or robs our body of a necessary nutrition. This is Dr. David Cathcart, Heartland Regional Medical Center.